What's up guys? I have another video and today I have a bow and arrow. And you're thinking that's not a bow and arrow, it's just a bunch of pipes. But it is a PVC bow and arrow. And uh, yeah, so it's like a three quarters inch pipe on the outside and then on the inside, I'm trying to get a place where I can show you. Here, I don't know if you can see it. So here's the three quarters inch pipe, and on the inside of that there's a half inch pipe, and then inside of that are two fiberglass rods. Now I couldn't find a half inch fiberglass fiberglass rod to fit in there perfectly, but uh, two of them work in there, pain in the ass to get in there. So, well, I didn't have the design for this. I copied it off another YouTube video. And I'll put that in the description of this video, so, uh, yeah, his is probably a bit better, he put some more modifications on it than me. I put a hand grip on, just out of, like, pipe insulation and duct tape to hold it down. Yeah, like that. And then that, this is the arrow rest, because I hate shooting off my hand, because it just doesn't fly right if I'm using gloves. And so... It's a pretty strong bow, about 50, 60 pound draw or whatever. And what we use for the string, because it's pretty strong, so it's a 50, 50 pound, uh, what is it, fishing, fishing line. And my dad made a sweet braid with this, so it will never break. And what we have are these uh, uh, training arrows with like the little blunt tips. And when you uh, knock the arrow, I guess that's what it's called, we put some electrical tape on right there. So it'll grab the back of the arrow and you won't need to, uh, you can just let it hang and uh, it'll stay fine. And this arrow rest definitely helps because if you're, if you're uh, shooting off your hand, well, I'm not an experienced bow shooter, so if you're going to shoot off your hand, I mean, that's fine, but I made the arrow rest because it helps a lot. And uh, this, unless you make the thing thicker, the string thicker, this definitely helps. And uh, I'm going to shoot into a box, not very far away, but I mean, just to show you what it does, see if I can, yeah. See if I can position it so you guys can see me shooting and the box in the same picture. Alright, so I'm gonna shoot from like 10 feet away. Not fully drawn, but, or fully pulled back, but. So yeah, it's, keep in mind it's not fully pulling back, and there's also there's also an additional box in here that both the arrows went into. So it's a pretty strong bow considering it's made out of PVC and fiberglass. So yeah, check out the other video if you guys want to figure out how to make this, and uh, yeah, give it a try. It's really fun.